Whether entering a new vehicle or updating an existing customer with a new vehicle, this input work can be accomplished in the three-tab file maintenance view ahead of time or the full five-tab order view. We do recommend always entering vehicles into brand new records rather than over-typing an existing record. This way the program can store repair vehicle history properly going forward. This also serves to support the change ownership function discussed in another clip. Therefore, if you do see existing vehicle details, click New to clear the screen for a fresh vehicle entry. The vehicle screen has fields that are either filled in by manual typing or automatically by VIN to code or license plate to VIN lookup functions. Plate to VIN lookup provides an even faster, simpler vehicle identification method. Just enter the license plate and click on Lookup. This will locate and fill in the vehicle identification number, year, make, model, and engine details. Vehicle attributes that are not decoded by VIN, such as transmissions, will appear for selection from option lists. Setup Shop Data Screen View includes an option to swap positions of the VIN number and decode fields with license plate lookup entry. If not using VIN decode or plate to VIN, be sure to use the provided year, make, and model drop down list entries so your vehicle records will seamlessly look up repair estimating and maintenance information. Having year, make, model, body style, and engine fuel filled in also makes it easier to order parts electronically by passing a fully qualified vehicle to integrated parts catalogs. If you should have any vehicles that don't appear on the provided year, make, model lists, may be entered manually and stored as one time vehicle records. You'll be able to write estimates and orders for these custom vehicle records. There just won't be any repair information to access or parts catalog lookups by passing vehicle information to them. The remaining fields on this screen are all explained in greater details in another clip.